Okay, next step, wood gas Ford part two. Um, pretty much got this thing running pretty good on regular gas. Redid all the wiring, plugs, points, condenser. Got a carburetor um, working on this new car, remanufactured carburetor, and it's running really good. And so, this is what I'm going to go with with the wood gas. We've had this truck running on wood gas, but I made some changes. We're going to go the two inch all the way. And take two inch pipe all the way down and then this will go down under the truck and come up in the back of the bed and so and then I'm going to be working on instead of using these real stiff gate valves I mean ball valves we're gonna we're gonna actually put a butterfly valve in one of these pipes and then mount a bracket over here and I'll have another like choke cable that will be running my air mixture for the wood gasifier so but this will get me started manually and the plan is to shut off the fuel put a new manual fuel pump in but I'm gonna shut that off with a ball valve start the truck up on gas then turn the bolt come out turn the ball valve off start up the gasifier come over here make some adjustments this will probably be open when I'm running gas set it to my sweet spot for the wood gas carburetor and I'm going to put a shut off valve here more most likely a ball valve or gate valve here and so they won't the gas fire won't be sucking air back to it through there so that's the plan I'm going to need about nine feet of, of hose to go up and under the truck and then come up in the bed roughly here and the gasifier will just be I'm going to put it lengthwise for now that's the only way it fits in its configuration so um, that's what we're gonna do and then on the dash we've got a choke cable there and I'm gonna get another choke cable for this extra spot and that's gonna run my air mixture on the uh, wood gas carburetor so truck still running good and uh, start right up so anything with the wood gas is not interfering with this at all a little lifter noise, but that's okay. And I got a little exhaust leak, but I'm not worried about that. All right, that's. In case you didn't know how to turn a truck off. <laughs> uh, film everything all right I think that's it folks and we've got redid the brake uh, wheel cylinder today freed that up so we've got brakes all around shoes are good and uh, adjusted everything so I got brakes and we are mobile with a 62 Ford and uh, hopefully next week I think by the end of next week we'll be driving this around the farm on the wood gasifier so just giving a little update and uh, signing off.